League announcing it's launched an investigation into the Phoenix Suns owner, Robert Sarver. He's facing accusations of racism and misogyny during his 17-year run with the team. That's according to damning ESPN reports out today. The outlet is now reporting it interviewed more than 70 current and former Suns employees. The accusations range from Sarver using the N-word to openly talking about oral sex in front of his workers. Sarver has vehemently, vehemently denied the accusations. In a statement, he told Global Sports Matters, so much of the ESPN report is inaccurate and misleading. Sarver also said, I would entirely welcome an impartial NBA investigation, which may prove our only outlet for clearing my name and the reputation of the organization of which I am so very proud. Well, it appears he's getting that investigation. CNBC's Perry Russom now with more on the reported accusations. I've been a passionate uh, basketball fan and uh, growing up in Arizona, a passionate Phoenix Suns fan. ESPN reports Robert Sarver's 17-year tenure as the owner of the Phoenix Suns has been toxic and sometimes hostile. The Suns' former head coach Earl Watson telling ESPN, back in 2016, Sarver said, you know, why does Draymond Green get to run up the court and say N-word? According to ESPN, Sarver repeated the word several times in a row. Watson said, you can't say that. Sarver responded, why? Draymond Green says N-word. The report says in 2013, Sarver preferred hiring a black head coach over a white head coach. A high-level executive telling ESPN Sarver said, these N-words need a N-word. ESPN reports in 2011, Sarver yelled at a female employee. The woman broke down in tears. Sarver said, why do all you women around here cry so much? According to ESPN, a female former employee says Sarver would use language including, do I own you? Are you one of mine? Two weeks ago, Sun's leadership released statements ahead of the ESPN report. Sarver says, I categorically deny any and all suggestions that I use disparaging language related to race or gender. The Sun's president and CEO Jason Rowley adding, this story is completely outrageous and false. ESPN reports one current business operations employee told them, if the commissioner comes in and investigates to see what the F is going on in Phoenix, he would be appalled. He's a fiery guy. He says what he wants when he wants to. Sarver was denying the allegations line by line in the report. Once the NBA is done with their investigation, the league could take some type of action against him. The Suns do play tonight, Shep. Curious to see if any players make a statement against him. We'll watch it. Perry Russom, thank you.